today's video, we're going to be doing McCall 7999. A lot of nines. Had to make sure I had the right amount. Uh, so it's a dress pattern with different variations. I did view C. It has a slit or a split in the back. Uh, and I used a velvet from my stash that I had. So I'm not sure where I really bought it from. Uh, but I did the open sleeve method. Let me know how I did. And I think that's all. So let's go make us a dress. So the pattern calls for you to attach seam binding to the shoulder seams. Uh, so you're just going to base that on to the back shoulder piece. And then you're going to pin your two back pieces together to make one. And you want to pin to the dot you're going to stop there and leave the space down below open to for your split and make sure you back stitch at the beginning i'm pretty sure i did i just don't have it filmed <laughs> so now that we have the back sewn together we're going to attach the front piece at the shoulder seam and the pattern says to do your shoulder and sides at the same time at this point but we're gonna leave the sides open because we're gonna do the open sleeve method. So we're gonna go and stitch. And once you have that all stitched, you're gonna lay it out. And then the dot of the sleeve should go with the shoulder seam. And you're going to match up your other notches. So now that you have that sewn, this is what it should look like. And from the right side, so you're going to take your right side together, match up your shoulder notches. I'm sorry, not shoulder, <laughs> sleeve notches. And you're going to pin from the sleeve of the dress all the way to the length of the dress. So now we're going to work on the collar and you should have notches on the collar piece to show. So with the right sides together, you're going to pin that. So once you have that sewn, you're going to put the collar piece wrong side together and match up those notches. And what I like to do is I like to create a basting stitch 
and here the velvet it goes rolling on me <laughs> So you're gonna go and base around the circle. And then this way, it'll be easier for us to attach the collar to the neck of the dress. So we right sides together. You're gonna pin. and stitch around. And now the last couple of steps is to hem the sleeve and hem the length of the dress. And so if anyone knows how to prevent velvet from ro rolling, please let me know. And here we have the end result. So I did have a few pieces of fabric and I tried to make like a little belt, but <laughs> I like the dress and I'll be wearing it. So thanks for watching. <laughs>